Hi, in this video we're going to take a look how to set up the uh, or configure the virus C for the uh, virus HE plugin so that all of the system settings are properly set up. Okay, so first of all, uh, when using the virus AG, you need to have your plugin in multi or multi single mode so that both LEDs are on. Uh, I hope you can read the display. I'm using a custom display and uh, it might be a bit dark, but uh, let's see. First of all, we go to system. And I'm just going to scroll into the beginning so that it's easy to go through of all of the settings. Um, actually, all this is um, multi-temporal settings, so they don't really count. But when we get to the virus settings right here, okay. So first of all, MIDI dump TX, single buffer. MIDI dump RX, enable, so that the virus can receive data from the plugin. Uh, global channel is set to one, on my case. Uh, panel is internal and MIDI. Either way you want, um, I would most likely go to use the uh, MIDI or internal plus MIDI. Soft through, off. RBG the send is off. MIDI clock RX auto. MIDI volume disabled. Program chains disabled. Multi program chains disabled. Device ID. This is really important and it's been set to 1. If you have multiple viruses, you want to set different device ID for each of the virus. MIDI control, low page is control. Uh, high page is system exclusive. And there's some other settings here as well, which you might want to take a look. Memory protect is off. I think that's all. So um, let's go to the virus DI. Okay, so uh, here is my virus DI2. And again, we are going to go to the settings, uh, but when using the plugin, you want to go to either sequence mode or multi mode, otherwise, the plugin won't work properly. So, let's go to configuration, and uh, I'm just going to go through the settings from, from this page knob behavior. So, uh, what I've got here is um, response is jump, display time 24, target is internal plus MIDI. Um, it's really how you want to use the, uh, use the virus, but I'm always keeping it on a internal plus MIDI so that the changes what I do affects in the virus and also it sends MIDI out data into the virus AG to keep the plugin updated. Uh, global tuning, there's nothing what I've changed. Um, system 105, all delays and all reverbs are enabled arpeggios and EQs enabled, uh, LED lux and BBM brightness LED mode. Memory protect is disabled so that we can write data from the uh, plugin librarian. Mm, navigation, value wrapping, random generator, and then we get to the MIDI, uh, one of three, global channel one, device ID is one. So um, and soft through is off. 
up node send of MIDI clock sync to external. This can be set to auto. Mm, yeah, well, sync to external is enabled, obviously. Um, MIDI volume disabled. Program change enabled. Uh, you can do disabled if you want because you can change the programs from the plugin interface. Receive dump enable. Transmit MIDI dump is, uh, well, it's not relevant for the plugin, but if you do a dump from the virus, you, you can basically choose what you're dumping. Then we get to the MIDI control. Uh, page A is control data. Page B is system exclusive. Inputs, these are not relevant for the plugin. Audio clock is not relevant. And then there's the soft knobs, and we're back to the square one. So that's the settings for both of the viruses, and um, the plugin is ready to roll. So let's start off with the Logic Pro X project and see how that goes. Thanks for watching. Bye.